All right, welcome back, guys. We're doing another father-son video on the Gears of War series. We finally finished it all. We played four and five. We had a previous video where we played the uh, one, two, three, and Judgment. Yeah. And now we've played all of four, all of five, including the DLC, and then we went back and played the DLC for Judgment. We're it wasn't a DLC. It was like an extra that came to the game. If you got 30 stars, oh, I think. if you went through it. And we got way more than 30 oh, stars, so... because it's those, uh... Challenges. Those challenges that are, yeah, like, that spray yeah. paint of, yeah. uh, the gear symbol on the wall, and you can go and you can choose to take it or not, but you had... And we did, like, most of them. So. Oh, yeah. We'll talk about 4 first. Pretty 4? Good. Well, pretty good. I, I really loved 4. I there were some high points in it. Like, that there... time I got crushed by a shelf. <laughs> we're in, like, this great big, kind of like a barn or greenhouse. It's where Marcus keeps his fucking tomatoes. No, you don't say the like, <laughs> no, no, no. Marcus, yeah, like, all these robots keep coming in there and you're fighting robots and they keep destroying his crop of tomatoes and that's, that's like his big line that we keep yeah. laughing at. Ah, my fucking tomatoes! There's a drop ship! Shit, they're gonna mess up my fucking tomatoes! You'll bleep that out. Leave mine uncensored. Good lord, the drop shot guys gave us problems. Yeah, because we, we breeze through this game pretty easily. So we, we kill off everybody, Mulcher guy, and there's us two playing and split screen. One guy. And then we have also two, two AI. Yeah. And that one drop shot guy, one guy was killing us, and we were just. That's it! No, 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 free! Find your happy place. Ah. It was so ridiculous that literally me and you and the two AI were hiding in a building and running out and shoot and jump back in and I, we were screaming and laughing and it was like he, he, you couldn't get hit by him because he was killing us there and then as soon as he would, killed us we have to do the thing the mission all over again you would put them into the house too and we would it was panic it was like a glitch I swear it was like a glitch or just a bullet sponge that we couldn't take out and he was hitting us in places that he should not have been able to hit us because of a drop <laughs> shot there, like it, it was ridiculous. It, it it was hysterical. You were on the floor. I was on. I was. You were dying. on the floor at one point laughing there. Twice, dying, isn't it? Yeah. Oh yeah, it was awesome. But uh, like the overall, the game, the game is like four was really good. I really loved it. I agree. Yes. To elaborate on the shelves. Yeah. So there's some props. They're ahead, so you don't expect the player to be there. Usually, you think they're taken cover I methodically so i run up and then the wind comes by and i'm i'm behind <laughs> it shooting out of it and then boom blows, it just crushes and blows me. the shelf over and instant kills you instantly <laughs> and if There's it didn't touch you do. it was an object that just flattened you i was so confused <laughs> until i saw it fall down again i was like, was like oh, the shelf killed me the shelf killed me yeah <laughs> Let's, let's just, we won't get into the story because we don't want to spoil anything for anybody. So let's just jump into our thoughts here for Ge Gears 5. And then when we're done, we're, what our plans are going to be is we're actually going to rank our favorite, like from our most favorite yeah. to our least favorite through the entire series. Gears 5, I thought Gears 4 was freaking awesome. I love Until it. I played Gears 5 and I was absolutely... This is garbage now. <laughs> it was absolutely blown away. I it, was blown away. I think the most memorable boss in this one is the one... The frozen guy the who ice. has a crazy amount it, it, of health. It is a really overpowered boss for like in the middle he, of the game. Sometimes like, he'll just... Usually he doesn't one shot him, but sometimes yeah. he'll just go... And he kills himself. I don't remember what is the name of the boss was. It was like a berserker... With yeah, jacked up on roids or whatever. We beat him and we kind of exploited it a bit. We we yeah we, we kind of, yeah we cheated a little bit I guess. And this whole time you're running around on like a frozen lake, lake right? basically. And uh, what you can do is you can shoot the ice. He'll fall in. He'll fall in. He'll freeze, and then you can get and get close and shoot him because that's when you can damage. Him. There's one spot there. Yeah, there's a very small spot where you can shoot him and actually kill him. I think it's from behind, right? Yeah. So. What you were doing is you were running up, freezing him with the freeze gun. And then when he was about we to break shoot, out. Yeah, and then when he was just about ready to thaw, you'd shoot the ice out from under his feet and he would fall in and freeze again and we'd get a boom. double. And we'd get a double. And, it, and even doing that. It took us. It still was a long fight. At, I'd say an hour and a half to defeat him with all the retries. Well, yeah, all the retries because he did kill us a bunch. And like it's the instant 20 kills. 20 minutes to beat him regularly. Yeah. We haven't uh, talked about the... DLC for this game. 
which I the like. DLC is really was good. almost like a different game. Had a lot of same simul you know, a lot of the same mechanics and everything. Jack's not there. Was completely different characters. You were a different party altogether. Yeah. And they were almost overpowered because they all had these special abilities. Oh yeah, my guy just you, you get into the ammo. I had, like, of course I had the you Irish did. guy. Of course you did. Yeah. By pure <laughs> chance. Yeah. But the DLC was fantastic. I loved it, and we got it for free. We got it for free on Game Pass. Yeah. Like I actually went out and bought this just like literally before we sat down to do the literally video. just for show. Just for show, yeah. Like, but I love the game, and I was talking to your mother there today. I was like, because I was looking at all the games in the show, and I was like. I wonder how many games I'll actually go back and play again. And then I automatically thought of like, when you have kids, are you going to want to play the Gear series with your kids? And I was like, oh shit, well, I want to be there and watch that. And maybe I can actually- You can be Chuck. <laughs> yeah, we can jump. Maybe we can hand the controller back and forth and play, you know. The Gears of War franchise is meant to be played couch co-op. And it is fantastic, couch co-op. It is. You meant you're meant to sit there with a friend and play when your your idiot son keeps running in Rambo style and dying. That's my move. Sometimes it I'm works, Rambo. dude. <laughs> Some... You're you're better than I am at the game for sure. There, but it was a lot of time. You had a lot. I think you might have had more deaths only because you go in there and go crazy. But no you probably time, had way more kills too. If you played this game, you know that there's a cloaking ability, and you can insta kill backstab enemies while it's up. Yes. But it's only up for a little bit of time, but you get more time if you kill enemies. Yeah, so if you can stealth so kill, one it's time, like a chain I kill. chained like 10, 12 in a row, clear half the It was crazy. The level. Sorry, all right. Let's let's start ranking them. What is your least favorite of the Gears series? And then we'll, we'll, we'll probably, stack them up here. Probably two. You know what? I would absolutely agree with you on that. It's not... Bad. The reason why it's funky. I did not like to is because of all the freaking vehicles. Like vehicle vehicles just in it. Oh there were whole missions where they were just you're just piloting I, stuff. I didn't mind the vehicles as much as you did, but yeah. I felt the game was also a little underwhelming compared to the other ones. What would be number because there's six total. So this is number six. So I personally what's number five? would say one. I, I'm agreeing with you on that one. One because, was glitched, by the way. Because there was glitches in it. it. It's it's an older game. There are a lot of glitches, and we were playing it on the uh, Xbox Series X. So we're playing through Game Pass. I, like I pop the disc in, but it just downloads the freaking you know Game Pass version there, obviously. Um, it, it we it crashed a couple times on us. So we have six, five. What's number four? I think we're I think we're getting pretty close oh, here. Now this one is a lot harder. You think this is gonna be the hardest one for Dick? I don't know about that. I yeah. think I don't what do you think? My opinion is Gears 3. That was also my opinion. Now I really liked Gears 3. Like after playing one, well I really liked one. Played two, wasn't a fan. Three was a redemption, was a thumbs up, definitely really yeah. good game. What is number three? What's your third favorite? No, I don't know if we have this one. Oh. I I like Judgment a little more than four. Did you? I did it's like because it. Because why? I just really liked a lot of the guns. There was a ton of guns that yeah. were not in any of the other games. More. Also, the challenge system was super fun. It really I added the to the game. System. The challenge system really added to because some of those challenges were so ridiculous that you couldn't even see, you know, like, wow, five feet crazy. in front of you. You like, want to do it then? No. Okay, uh, let's uh, do yeah, it. Yeah, um, I gave him, he had veto power. He's like, he would ask me, you want to do it? I, and then Out most of, of them, most of them, I said yes, but I said, well, I'll do whatever you want. And Eva, you, I think we picked almost every one of them. I think we, we, we didn't do ones one. with Hammerverse, because Hammerverse sucked. Oh, yeah, we didn't like the Hammerverse gun that much. So the next one is for you, is it four? For, yeah, for me, and I do the. I really uh, like four because yeah. of tomatoes being hit by a shelf and the drop shot guy were just funny moments that made it so much. All right, so I had to add this part in because the boys don't know about it, so it'd be a fun little Easter egg for them. But if you destroy all Marcus's tomato plants, he goes on a forty-second rant, and we have that clip for you. So let's watch. I don't know how long I've worked on this fucking house alone. You know what it's like being a fucking hermit, fixing a house, 
There's no Home Depot out here, you fucking assholes. Fucking tomatoes. They fuck my tomatoes up! God damn it! Add that to the fucking list! God damn it! Those are Doms, for Christ's sakes! I grew those from Dom seeds! Fuck! Those are Dom's goddamn seeds, for Christ's sakes! I'm never gonna have a fucking good sauce again! I can't make Dom sauce! Fuck you guys! This bullshit! Fucking Damon Baird, you're a cock! Like I'm dead, like I said before, I'm giving you the, the veto power here. I assume you think that four I... judgment. It's really close. It's really close, but I do think I enjoyed the story more in four than I did in judgment. I'm so sorry, we were playing I'm... these for the story? <laughs> <laughs> I know. The story know. in four so lasted we've like already five said minutes. Judgment is your second favorite. I think so. Yeah. So saying that, that would make Gears 5 was absolutely phenomenal. I see that's it's your our favorite. most favorite, and yes, I can agree with you 100% on that one. These two, it's really close. They're it's a like, toss up. I love them both. Yeah, it's a really a toss up. So here, here, I'm gonna add one more question here. I'm gonna ask you: If you were to make the Gears 5 DLC its own game, where would that fall in here? Oh, because it's weird, eh? Oh, that's a tough question. <laughs> yeah, it was. I. Re it was. It was not long. It was short but sweet. It was really good. It was really good. That's tough. Damn it! Now, if that that could do its own thing, if they were can would continue on with a like branch off of the main series, like you know, you're not you're not having Marcus and his son, you know, and all those guys, and you did like a, a whole different thing that it really worked well. It was fun. Alright, where would you put the DLC in here? Where would you put the DLC? Because I'm blanking out. So you have no idea where you're going to put the DLC in this? It's a bad range of... Oh, here. <laughs> it's probably in this area. Oh, I, I honestly enjoyed the DLC for 5 more than 4. I agree. So for me, it would drop in like right in here. If it was a longer game, like the DLC was longer, whoa, that would have been awesome. Honestly, I think I agree with it. Okay, cool. It was really good. Really cool. The, also, the final boss was fun. I wish it didn't let end off on a cliffhanger. <laughs> Maybe it's gonna it's like open a, for the more most DLC. exciting part there. More DLC there. Not not for this one, but maybe for like <laughs> maybe before Year Six comes in. Love the series. So, what we are playing next was actually we had asked people before on our other Gears video, and people had recommended a bunch of different stuff. We've actually started Army of Two. We have. We actually started it today. <laughs> so far, I thought it was going to have aged badly, and I was really wrong. I agree. It, oh. it controls better than, honestly, controls better than Gears of War. We're done. Thank you guys for watching, and please leave in the comments, recommend more couch co-op games that a father and son duo would like, because after we beat the Army of Two series, we'll talk about that, and then we're gonna need more more people that are more games to play, right? Yeah. See you next year when we're done with Army of Two, <laughs> which isn't there, but... No, it's not the deal. We're playing it on Xbox 360. <laughs> yeah, I know. Okay. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. See you next time.